I am Isabella Rojas Ismael from Baranaque City. Miss Baranaque, Maria Isabella Ismael. Isabella is a niece of former Miss Universe Margie Moran, a ballerina since the age of four and a De La Salle BS Psychology graduate. She practices meditation and believes in giving everyone a chance to live the life they envision for themselves. Paranaque City, Maria Isabella Ismael. Isabella Rojas Ismael, Paranaque City. Zandri List of our top 15, the envelope will be presented by Mr. Alan Ocho, partner of Sisip Gores and Valayo Company. Rounding it to the top 16, from Paranaque, Maria Isabella Ismael. Congratulations, so from to our last contender of our top 16, Miss Paranaque. Throughout this journey, you have discovered that you are a phenomenal woman who is conditioned for greater. How can you create a positive and lasting impact to the world around you? Time starts now. One of the things that I've learned that is valuable is actually staying true to yourself and being as authentic as you can be no matter where you are. And that's something I learned as I went on in this journey. And I'm very thankful that I've been able to re realize that. I'm thankful that I am who I am today. I am thankful that I am able to show you all exactly who I am. And I can't wait to continue doing that and hopefully inspire more people to be themselves as well. Be proud of who you are and that's the most that you can do for everybody and for yourself. Thank you so much. Round of applause, Miss Pat our final candidate, Perniake, Maria Isabella Ismael.
candidate, Maria Isabella Ismael Paranaque. It's time for us to now get to the top five finalists. Our final contender is from Paranaque, Maria Isabella Ismael. Congratulations once again to our top five and also just a word to all of the candidates, you all did phenomenal. You are all amazing and beautiful and wonderful women. And to make it this far through all of the pandemic, through all the ups and downs, through all the trials, the struggles and the tribulations, you guys are all winners. Paranaque, Maria Isabella Ismael. Good evening. Good evening, good evening everybody. You seem very confident. It might just be my voice. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Let's see. So I will ask you two questions. You were able to pick a number backstage. After you talk for 30 seconds, you will hear a chime like this. Then I will ask you another question. At the end of 30 seconds, you will hear a chime as well. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. Your first question. To a child who has never seen a pageant, how would you describe a beauty queen. I would tell that child that a beauty queen is somebody who is, first and foremost, a human being. She's somebody that is proud of who she is, but most importantly, she is somebody that brings hope. When she wears that crown on her head, it's not just because she's the most beautiful girl in the room, but it's because she's the woman who inspires hope. She's the woman who inspires love and productivity and somebody being authentic. And a beauty queen is somebody that we should always look up to. Thank you. Time for your second question. This pandemic has made clear our priorities, essential or non-essential. Where do pageants stand in a time of crisis? In my experience with the pandemic and being in one of the most prestigious pageants in the Philippines. I have realized that pageants are something that can give Filipinos hope, and it's something that can give Filipinos something to look forward to. It's something that we as Filipinos, as a pageant-loving nation, it's something that we're so proud of. It's something that gives us life. And that's the relevance of what a pageant is. We help each other out, we help other people, and we help ourselves grow. We help each other prosper through any negative aspect. Thank you very much. Round of applause, Paranaque. Beautiful and empowered Filipinas standing right here on our stage tonight. Let's go ahead and take a final look at the five phenomenal contenders for the crown of Miss Universe Philippines 2020. And finally, Paranaque, Maria Isabella Ismael. Only two remained. Let me remind you that in case the winner fails to fulfill her duties and obligations, the first runner-up will take over as Miss Universe Philippines. I will announce the name of the winner first. That means the other contender is our first runner-up. Ladies, take a deep breath. It is time for the moment of truth. Miss Universe Philippines 2020 is
Fitness Iloilo. Philippines organization to our judges, sponsors, and to all of our phenomenal delegates, our most heartfelt appreciation for all of the support and participation in this year's.